Thank you. New data today shows human trafficking cases are up from 2015. The group Polaris says there were 49 cases reported in Mississippi this past year. A press conference today is aimed at raising awareness of the issue. Our Quentin Smith was there. Within the past 10 years, there's been more than 150 cases of either sex trafficking or labor trafficking right here in Mississippi and all throughout the country and the state. Law enforcement agencies recognize the month of January as Human Trafficking Awareness Month. Northern Transportation Commissioner Mike Taggart, along with a special FBI agent, spoke with officers with the Mississippi Department of Transportation about putting a halt to this growing problem. Taggart says there's no certain part of the state where this problem exists. It exists the most. It's happening everywhere. Now, back in 2014, Governor Phil Bryan created the Human Trafficking Task Force in an effort to address this issue. And earlier this month, MDOT officers were trained on how to identify potential victims and how to approach them when they're confronted with a potential human trafficking situation. Human trafficking can take place anywhere. Uh, and, and we have seen cases uh, 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 throughout the country and certainly throughout our state over the course of the last few years. Um, so it's possible anywhere, and that, I think that's the message. Now, if anyone ever encounters a potential human trafficking situation, you're encouraged to call the National Human Trafficking Hotline. And remember, you can report anonymously. If you want the information, feel free to go to our website at WCBI.com. Back to you.